you all gonna learn about how to add screen image and how to add dust green effects in your snap lens so let's get started so yeah first open the new project yeah so here we are and yeah so first we will learn how to add dust grain effect in staplins so for that we're gonna open and tap on screen image and yeah here we are mm, okay so we'll click here and um, yeah it's gonna add some grain open okay you can adjust the sizes by choosing one of them like if i want to have stretch mode here yeah. you can choose the blend mode okay i'm choosing it i have to see screen okay and now it's off light i think it's better yeah and we'll just make a duplicate of this yeah here we are we'll just add dust file okay from here and uh, dust yeah so yeah here we are fine just add another blend mode. How about lighting? Or the screen one? It's better. Yeah. So we have added the both green and the dust file. Okay. So to make my lens look good, I'll just add color correction here and I'll choose this empty one. And here we are. Mm, used mm, like this one yeah so it has given some colors to it see earlier it was this and now it is this yeah so we are done with this fine and now what i will do that i will just add one script from here Okay, so this script is here. I'll just copy from here. And um, yeah, here I am adding a script. Yeah, so I'm done. I'll just press Central S. So that my script is saved and you can see here like if it's saved here yeah so i'll just close from here fine okay so why i added this screen image i just want to tell you that i'm making a lens that will have effect of both grain and dust fine so i want to make people uh, like they have a choice basically they have a full choice that if they want to use the grain effect they can use that or if they want to have that dust effect they can use that also so i'm adding both in one lens fine so what i'm going to do i'm going just to tap here create scene object add component choose the script one add script the safe script is here only and yeah Okay, like how many objects you have? Okay, like how many objects you have? I just have the two ones. The one is the grain and one is the dust one. So yeah, they are the two. I'll just add one. I hope it works. Yeah, it has worked. 
so you can see as like i just tap on this it has been uh, like it has been changed to the dust one and now it's green yeah so perfect i have done this but now i also want to like if someone doesn't want to use any grain effect or any of the dust effect but it does uh, but it just want to have this only that this filter look or this color look so i will add one more for that okay so how how i'm going to do just i will just duplicate this fine okay so here we are i think this is the duplicate one yeah here's the duplicate one i'm going to choose Mm, what I'm gonna choose? I'm gonna choose nothing actually. Leave it. I'm just gonna delete this one. Yeah, just add a new one. Add new screen image here, and see you're just gonna see this one, this image. Yeah. So what I'm going to do? I will just reduce the alpha, and here we are. So and I will add this third one in the screen image. I will add the value and yeah, here we are. Hmm. So yeah. Hmm. Wait a second. Yeah. So you can see this. Okay. So the thing is worked. Like, see the grain effect, the dust effect, and the normal filter effect. Yeah. So I will add. Other pick, like import my ones and like see here it is. Okay and yeah, so grain, dust, and the normal filter effect. Yeah. So I hope it's been clear to you that how to add dust grain in one lens only. Yeah. So yeah, it's been done. And yeah, as per to my promise in uh, which I've been done in the previous tutorial that I will tell you how to add or how to import other images uh, like other than these other than these default ones which have been added by Snapchat. Yeah, so I will tell you how to do it. See, you just have to press here and you want to my you just have to look at that you just have to tap from files and what you will do now you will just uh pick any of the images you have or you can download it from google okay or you can download it from pixar too but you can use paint and trust and you can use google as well for that yeah i will add this one see what happens see here it appears Yes, I will just click it to here and here we are done. So I have, I just told you that how to add or how to import other images rather than the provided ones. Yeah, so we are good. See grain effect, dust effect and the normal one. So perfect. Now I will tell you that how to make that street lens that you have mostly seen or used in Snapchat. Okay, so that is we are going to do like how to add screen, screen image and how to use this script again okay fine uh, let's do it so for that we're gonna use the new project we'll just save this one okay. yeah so here we are we'll just go and uh, open the new project file and uh, it's opening take some time yeah. and yeah now it's been opened and what we'll do we'll just add some screen images okay this one fine we'll make duplicate of these yeah i will have we'll just have four images here done so i will import the but I just have to import the uh, picture files. Okay, it doesn't have that.
Yeah, here we are. So I have imported more than four files. I just have to check it out. Okay, these are same. Okay, this one is same. I'll just remove it. Done. So what I have to add, see what I will do. Now, uh, yeah, here we are. I will just add a new image. Okay, for that I have to just turn off the other ones because it will make a mess and it will look like a confusion, fine. You can do it as you want, fine. Yeah, so I have done the stretch mode and it has been fitted to the screen. You will see in the iPhone 8 mode. Yeah, it's done. I don't see any gaps. And here we go to the next one. So yeah, we'll add from here. Let's call it this one. Yeah. You can choose any of the modes. It's your choice. It depends totally upon you. Okay. You can add the fill mode. Like just adjust it to the screen size. Yeah, done. Fine. Let's move on to the another. And yeah, here we are. And just doing this another one. I'll add this one here. So I'll use the stretch mode here. Okay, it's done. I'm not liking this mode. <laughs> Let's choose the fill one. Okay. Better than the previous one. Yeah. Just turn off this one and yeah, here we are to the fourth and the last one. And yeah, it is done. Okay, finally it is done. So what I will do, I will just turn on the another ones. It's done. Fine. So you are going to tap here, create scene object and okay, fine, fine, fine. I have not added the script. Sorry for that. I just forgot. And here we are starting the script again. We are just pressing the handle V and pressing handle S. It is saved here. Yeah. Closing this one. Adding the saved one. And yeah, here we are. So we have taken the four images. I will add the four values here. Yeah, so here we are, starting from the first one. And yeah, we are done. You can just tap here one, two, three, and four. We are done. So I have also told you that how to make how to make screen image like streak that like I have told you that how to make that streak lens and yeah so we are done here I hope this tutorial helped you okay and if it helped you don't forget to subscribe my channel don't forget to like this video and if you want any other improvements in the coming videos you can just comment down in the comment section below and it is done Thank you and have a nice day.